In this video, I'm going to show you how to link your PS5 or PS4 to your phone so you can do a bunch of different things on it. So the first thing you're going to want to do if you're on the PS5 is you want to make sure that the account you're signed in on right now is the same account you're going to be using on the PlayStation app. So I've already done that and now I'll show you exactly what to do. So you've downloaded the PlayStation app on your phone and now we're going to actually open it. Once you're here, you'll see in the top right corner, there are the settings cogwheel. So you'll only see this if you sign in with your ID, that's the same one as the one you're signed in on your PlayStation. So we're gonna go to the settings cogwheel in the top right corner here. And from here, if you scroll on downwards towards console management, you'll see link console to app. So I'm going to click on that and you'll see my PS5 right here, PS5 800. Now here's the thing. It gives you two options. If you're using a PS5 and you're signed in with your PSN account on your PS5 and you're signed in with the same PSN account on your phone, it should automatically connect it. Now, if you're on a PS4, it says right here, on your console, go to settings, account management, and activate as your primary PS4 and activate it. So long story short, on the PS4, if you're not on the primary account, this isn't going to work. So now that our device is linked, I'm just gonna press confirm and it is all done. You are now connected to the PlayStation app. You can download games on the PlayStation app if your uh, console's in rest mode or you're not even home. You can check out all the different trophies. You can talk to friends. You can literally do everything on the PlayStation app. It's almost like a mini PlayStation barring the actual games. So I hope this video was helpful. Be sure to like and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one.